This protocol includes a step-by-step -step procedure of how constructing nanostructured photoelectrodes for efficient light-assisted hydrogen production in microgravity environments. It also includes an electrode testing procedure of how to test these photoelectrodes at the BREAM drop tower, where 10 to the minus 6 G can be generated in 9.2 seconds of free fall. It is observed by us and other research teams that electrochemically generated gas bubbles stick to the electrode surface in microgravity conditions due to the absence of buoyancy. Nanostructure in the catalysts generates catalytic hotspots, which improves the detachment of gas bubbles and the overall efficiencies. The procedures will be demonstrated by Ömer Akai, a great student in our laboratory at FU Berlin. To begin, apply silver paste to attach the ohmic contact to a thin plated copper wire. Thread the wire to a glass tube and use black chemical resistant epoxy to encapsulate the p-type indium phosphide sample and seal it to the glass tube. Under a fume hood, place the 0.5 square centimeter polished indium face of p-type indium phosphide in 10 milliliters of bromine methanol solution for 30 seconds to etch for removing native oxides. Then rinse the surface with ethanol and ultra-pure water for 10 seconds each and dry the sample under nitrogen flux. Use a borosilicate glass cell with a quartz window as a photoelectrochemical cell. And place the p-type indium phosphide electrode in the cell in a stand.